It's a small adjustment, it's not the end of the world, but no, I am not used to this weapon at all. It's not nearly... The, the cloak is not nearly as fluid anymore. Or you can't like go in and out of fights, or weave in and out of fights the same way. You kind of have to like... It's a longer vanish bomb. You can go in and out of fights a little bit, but it costs essentially your entire cooldown. Bruh. Better melee wins. I have a hard time understanding how, like, what's going on with this game. Why it's not, like, performing as well. So, I can't say for sure. Like, I may have been wrong the whole time, but... Dude, mind give it till their opinion about light nerfs. Well, the nerfs themselves seem pretty strong. Like, just on its own, it's a big hit to meta light. I'm so not used to this gun. I, I was debating going into the firing range, but I don't think it's gonna help. I already wasted my all my invisibility doing that. I mean, you can probably relearn it. Again, it's not as fluid as it used to be, but... We're getting there, we're waking up. Frames 130. What's happening? It's because um, I think there was a guy with uh, sledge this game, wasn't there? Yeah, heavy. The red team. Trend-setting winner in this match, it's the Vogues. Congratulations to our rising stars. Light Cloak was the only way light could be relevant against good players. And even then, even then it wasn't all that. Both Stun Gun and the cloak makes up for the fact that you have a fucking tiny ass health pool. I 
And what's like maybe I'm wrong, but what's confusing is that from from my perspective, it's, it's not a problem. I think anything that is anything that is a nerf to like what I've noticed since the game came out is that people especially like reddit or discord whatever the casual side of the community they have a lot of stupid takes on the game and a lot of like stupid complaints and sometimes you have some very and they're unreasonable and sometimes some of them get popular like light hate if it, at least if if embark listens to him it's a problem if they don't listen to him it doesn't fucking matter which i thought they were doing for a long time but again, since they are apparently listening to them, makes me wonder. Okay, I don't know. What, I don't know what Red is doing. Enemy spotted, down there. I can't even go back in stealth anymore. That feels so bad. Period. And this whole witch hunt to nerf light is insane to me. And has been also been going on for like, again, four months. And now when people have gotten, well these people have gotten what they wanted, you know what's gonna happen? They're gonna complain about something else. Because it's not about the fucking invis or something, it's about them being bad at the game. I definitely think old stun was unbalanced as hell, because I didn't play in beta. But I've been told, um... Old stun would slow your, um, aiming speed, uh, sensitivity as well. That's kind of fucking broken. Yeah, light is still the worst class in the game. I, I don't know why everyone's being saying the opposite. It's so strange to me. But like someone said, it's because a lot of um, casual players. Which I guess is fair. Uh, it's on the way to B. Okay. But this gun is still bad. I, w I saw a guy on- I was reading comments, I saw a guy on reddit who was uh, talking- he had that, like a whole thing with stats. If you guys read the comments to reddit, maybe you've seen that. Um, I think it was about the patch notes. I'll see if I can find the comments later, maybe someone in chat can find it. They're basically quoting like the amount of people that have like the win rates or something. It was like a win- how many people have unlocked the achievement of winning like a hundred games on light or whatever class it was. And then uh, how many people have play? I am paraphrasing it. I'm gonna find the exact comment. I know somebody in the chat knows it. Um, it. It doesn't matter, but according to his stats, like he was talking about how l not a lot of people, or like Light is the second most played class, but I believe it had the least win rate. Don't have the least on achievement. Yeah. I was like, I don't remember the exact, the exact numbers, but it was like the middle of the pack in the amount of people with the achievement and then but uh, what i found what was interesting is that heavy heavy had a, a way lower pick rate and a higher amount of people who have won all those games Gateway, 
They're triple light on um, that team, right? Oh shit. Man, I can't even go stealth again. X Defiant uh, stream tomorrow, yeah. I'm still using Invis the old way. It's messing me up. He should have killed me there, he messed up. The big splash swooped up a cash box. Watch out in there. The tough shells just left their opponents in the lurch. The big splash are catching a wave. They've started a cash out. I'll take it. Our contestants need to focus on the strengths of their team and use them to succeed. Definitely seems to have slowed them down a little bit. Like that light got caught off guard by the. The Rexos have respawned. Let's see how they bounce back. Vice cool them. The top shells are back in full numbers after being down to one contestant. A team wipe mishap for the retros. Our contestants should keep in mind that wiping an enemy team cuts their cash total in tournament matches. This goes I messed up. Ways, of course. It's stuck in um, a wall or something there. Only 30 seconds on the clock. Glitching the screen. The retros are back on the scene. What? How? What? That's. That's really fucking scuff. And the result is in. With a full retrospect of the match, we can say that the retros earned that victory. Thanks again to our sponsor. The powerhouses are opening vault two with brute force. Maybe that's why the Facebook videos haven't been doing so well anymore. It's all the lead paint gamers. Disrupting their tech. Gateway blink. The powerhouse has got the cash box. Didn't think that went through. The big splash grabbed the cash box. What is he shooting at? Why am I even trying to fight anyone with this thing? Of course the servers are crapping themselves in my last game. That is a certified finals banger. Up. 
And this thing has a depressingly low DPS. It's not even that low. That's the weird part. I think that, no, it's effective DPS that's low. The actual DPS is. I think it's basically the same as the. Um, Uh, XP. Not because of the ball off necessarily. Even though that probably has an effect, I think it's more that the. It's just so inaccurate. Late. I'm not going for those. A creative display from our contestants today. We don't give points for artistic impression, but maybe we should. The big splash. I think like we have a really long uh if I just like get even more time to adjust, I can probably start hitting shots of it, but I feel like VNS literally requires you to play the game differently. Well, not play the game differently, but you need to like aim completely differently. Oh shit. It messes me up. Is that a frag? That was a frag. Because they said we're like spending extra time testing it. So that makes it sound like it's gonna be a larger, maybe like a rework for it. Doesn't know about the descent technique. <laughs> So, oh, light is so stupid sometimes. I'm not getting this shit. It doesn't even matter. I just realized you have no money. I'll take those. I guess he got the drop on him. Exactly.